Hey guys, what is up? I am Double Driven. Um, some more Invigorate hand buff. I uh, made a bit of an adjustment. I took out the Council and I put in Alarin for more uh, scenario tempo. Um, if this deck secures last say, you are going to be super happy because you're just, especially if you have Skags in hand. Um, it's still the same type of combo with, um, you know, either the one two punch Valley Watcher or uh, Skags. Um, you know, you do have good options with uh, Forest Protector. Uh, side note, Forest Protector does not pull Waylay. Waylay is a tactic. Um, for all the people that don't watch the intro but watch the videos and they're going to tell me I misplayed, I already know. <laughs> um, but uh, I, I, I just love this list. I really do. I think it's one of my better creations. It, um, the idea is to hopefully have like Dunka or Smuggler. If you do feel like you need, if it's a deck you know where they're going to have like 4 or 5 damage and something seems a little bit too vulnerable, you can use one leader charge to possibly get say Dunka to stick. Uh, Call of the Forest can be huge, but you want to try to win round one. Um, if you have to play the scenario, it might get a little bit dicey. Um, but if you're on red coin and you do it, it's not that bad because you're just going to play round two until your opponent can't catch up no more. And you're going to have Lasse and you're going to be really happy. Um, cards you don't want in hand, Bountiful Harvest, you want to try to pull that with Simless. You do have Circle of Life and Rebuke options for it, but if you can get this to pop out while, say, you have Scenario and Dolbefana on, this card's going to pop off so hard. You can Overswarm, too, especially against Nilfgaard. Nilfgaard hard counters this deck like you wouldn't believe, um, except for a Clog Friend, which you're going to find out. Um, but... Uh, you can get so much tempo with Alarin. You want to be careful too with the swarming of the Blathanas that you don't block your Alarin. That's a possibility as well because you can get so many cards with the scenario. But, uh, you know, you do got defenders too. Um, you might get lucky on a, a Torque buff um, to pop off on one of these. Uh, the Dull Blathana Sorcerers, you always want to try to play these, then play a Whisperer so you can get the double procs if she lives. If, you, if it's got a lot of buffs on it, it's probably for sure going to live. Um, Riot Saboteur is probably the worst card in the deck, but it's just a nice dry pass play. If for some reason you can't win round one, you can maybe bump up a Dolvathana. You can maybe bump up Simless to get him out of uh, coup range. Uh, but uh, and, Or worst case scenario, just bump up another Valley of the Watcher. Um, but uh, three games today. Um, I hope you guys enjoy them. Uh, either tomorrow or Wednesday will be a Skellige rain list. I was going to put it up last Friday, but I'm going to be kind of short on content this week, so I wanted to get some stuff rolling for this week. Uh, so uh, Skellige rain list that I came up with. And, but this one here, man, this one's going to... its It feels really rewarding, you know what I mean? Like it, it, it just it feels so good to just smack something with this Skags. It's just... It's MVP if you can get last say. Thank you guys so much for everything. I will see you at the end. So straight damage. We got the good coin. Actually though, I think sometimes you're better off on the other coin because you get the buffs. And they get a lot of tempo. I never want the Bountiful Harvests in hand. And I currently have no hand buff. Other than this, so that's kind of rough. So he's going with that. So I don't want to use Call of the Forest just yet. Because he's just going to kill it. What if we do it? What if we go with the scenario? 
Because if we don't get last say, he just nukes it with Geralt. Oh, he's a... Uh... He's a sunset friend. That's totally fine. Um, we go here. Maybe this is incorrect, but I have no hand buff. Like, I missed out on... Dunka... Smuggler... I, c I could go circles, but... So he's going rain. Okay. So we go... We go here, right? Smack this once. Smack it again. We get our Alleran out. 27 points. These guys are really sad, though. And him being so far behind... I think I can go with the Dunka. I don't really have any more specials left, but... We start buffing up the Skags. Currently, special-wise, we only have Waylays for the Protector. He keeps playing. He gets two procs here. If one of them hits Dunka, I think we're really sad. So he's trying to keep his sunset. Oh, here it comes. So he's got to use two leader charges? Does he hit Dunka twice? Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. So, I think we abandoned the Dunka. We just go here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we get one more proc out of it. We had all their tactics. Whoops. You learn something new every day. You learn something new every day. <laughs> um, so if we play Simless... He has two leader charges. That does not... Oh, okay. But it's not really that great. Like... I could play one of these. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I think we saved some for right now, but... I think I could just go for the bleed here. I'm watching. If I can save the Simless. So he has pings. So that's five. Need and that's seven. So this is this is eight. I guess we should have just used it again. 
how many? So it hits for two. I guess we just, well, yeah, I guess we just use it. So we kill this. And we stay up. Okay. This is huge. If we can keep this last say Skaggs, I think we got him. Um, so what's his cards left? Um, does this play Portal? I don't think so. I could see... What's the name coming into play? Okay. Alright. So we go here. Hit the torque. Nice. Nice! Skags, okay. Does he kill it? He does not. We go Dolblathana. So we're gonna get... He's gonna use Leader Charge, right? Three ping. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. I think we still keep going. Boy, that I would love to have that uh thing right now. This is just value bleed. Um, I would like to get the location out of him. I guess. Brookvar Hunter. Honestly, I think we played the Torque as well. Alright. And then I think we just pass. Um, he might have a dead Geralt, to be honest. Um, if we get Ithleen... He's out of leader charges. So are we, but ours are up to 6 on Sheldon, which is cool. We're going to get something good out of him. Flat out. Heat wave. Okay. So that's huge. So heat wave. He has totem still. Do we force a totem out of him? I don't think so because we could just kill one with skags. But last say skags is huge. And we get one more point of carryover on skags. So, and we can also be uninteractive. The defenders are really bad though right now. Unless we play Simless and get value off of them. But these are just going to be huge. That's huge. I mean, we just go uninteractive. This seems like perfectly fine. I could play Ithlene first. But if he has like... damage it's going to be difficult for him he also has um the other gerald quen so that's what 11 points xavier um we don't care what he banishes yeah, we really don't care we can just do this i knew it was going to go on there <laughs> i just knew it um it's going to get awkward for him though he's straight damage Yeah, I'm not waylay. I don't care. I do want to play this second to last so I could possibly get my procs. So here comes the Quen. See, it's annoying for him. Into Gerd. Yeah, really annoying. So he's losing out on so much value. We keep a unit, which is nice. Go here. So we can actually go Ithleen. So it's Gerd. So he's going to kill this one Death Wish unit. He thinned all the way to one. So he drew his whole deck. He still has a Hunter. Possibly in hand. Maybe. Or he just plays one. Fakusha into discard. 
Oh, he got, there was two hunters. So he goes Coral. And we can play around it, which is huge. So he's 21 points, but we have a, a freebie. He drew all his cards. So we go here. Sheldon's going to hit for a boatload. Sinless is going all in the same row. We don't have to worry about Gerd. Does he have Muff Mushy Truffle? Ah, Yalmar. So he gets full value on that. Alright. So we go here. We bring up both Bountiful Harvests. Okay. Go back row. And front row. So this goes here. This goes here. And he has to decide, but... He just kills this, right? His last card is a... Bear Witcher. It's a dead Geralt. Wow. Um, so we go here. We just take the tempering. And then, uh... The beefy boy. GG. GG. Alright. Oh. So, last say versus last say. Um... Okay, we got Skaggs in hand, that's good. Um, drop this, we need some hand buff, please. Since we're on the bad coin. These are useless if they don't get a buff. But he might have damage stuff. Okay, so what's this for? Dunka, I guess? But we wanna get some things down first. How many units we got in hand? Did we want a buff? We don't really need to buff Force Protector. Holgar. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Damage unit by two. Whenever you play a ship, boost it by one. Whenever you play a pirate, deal one rain damage. Okay. What if we just. Because that seems like it's this whole spiel here. What if we just go here? Let's do this. Let's go one, two, well, we don't need to buff this. Two, three, four, five. Okay. And then we'll go here first. Okay, so we're getting some good buffs. Next we can go Defender. Then we go Dolblathana Whisperer. And if he doesn't answer it or pass, we can Sinless and really get ahead of him. Hammond, so he's straight Pirates, huh? That's fine. So, I guess that dies, but, I mean, do we really care? Um, damage an enemy unit by two. Okay. So we just go here, and let's see if he... Is, is ready to commit. Okay. So, here we go. Simless, Bountiful Harvest. We're going to get Alarin out as well. Uh, this is a good play. Because we got our girl down. We get another one. That's beautiful. Ugh, stop gurgling like that. And Alarin will show us the way. And he should pass here. But we're getting last say. We could just play Rebuke. If he doesn't pass, we're pulling Dunka. He does not pass. That, sir, I believe is a mistake. Alright. 
so first we go here. We take the tempering. On the dwarf. That's an engine. Go in here. Um, we take the waylay. We might overswarm. And we are just going to go for the carryover with Dunka. 42 points. We have Bountiful Harvest 2 now enabled on our Forest Protector. 48 points. I think he got caught off guard real fast. Um, he needs 12 points. Granted, he's got his little mini engine here, but... Yeah. Alright, so if we could draw the scenario, we're going to be in huge shape. I think we can get leader out. We need scenario and a another elf. There's the elf. Okay. Okay. This is good. So we drop this. Do we go there? Is that the hand? Uh, it'd be nice to get Ithleen. But all these are component pieces. Does this ever live though? I mean, if it pops off, it pops off. Okay. So, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Uh, I think we go back row. All right. Seems okay. Next, we're going to play the Bethana. Back row. Coral. Okay. So he's going to have tempo. He's going to have... What's her name next? Alright. So we can move her to the back row, possibly. Ah. Uh, that's huge to get out of them. Um, but it gives us a waylay and a secondary target here, which is huge. So we go here. Pop that. That's beautiful. 18. Next we get the bleed down. We just want last say. I'm sure he's iced as well. Isn't Ice the pirate, I believe? I think we continue to... It's a good pass, but I think we keep uh, we keep jamming. What if... Well, yeah, we go yeah, here for one bleed. This is going to hit for three. But we're getting these big pieces out of them. See, he's, he might be discarding stuff he doesn't want to. He's going to get maybe... Oh, he got both. Just the one. Okay, that's fine. That's, that's good. Um, so we go here. I'm watching. Smack. Maybe we should have took the card. Ah, now we see. Now we see. Um, give two ships, two armor, and three pirate ships in your hand. Order, damage a unit by one. What do we got left? We got Ithleen, Sorcerer. I think we just keep playing, to be honest. I think we get everything out of them that we can. Maybe I should have played the Protector. I wasn't going to risk with missing Ithleen's buff anyways. And if we can go uninteractive for a couple turns, I think he's just in big trouble. Okay. Um, I mean, this really doesn't hit that much. But his leader is better than ours. So I think we jump out. I maybe should have... Went with the protector, but I 
or took the card advantage. The card advantage would have been nice, but we still get last say. We got hand buffs here. That's no good. That's okay. Uninteractive is going to be huge. Um, that's it. That is a hand because he wants to hit stuff. And if he can't hit stuff, he's going to be unhappy. Children, elders. So it's a one and. I guess we get the next one for free. Totem. Uh, we take it now because it's just extra points. He's going to kill this. He's Yuta though, right? Like, I could just discard and just... Is that enough? We hit for... He discarded it already. So he's going to play Fakusha. Huh. Okay. Turgvi. <laughs> Alright, so... But he dis... So his, he's going to play Fakusha to pull Yuta? No, Fakusha doesn't summon. I think we go here. We do get the Dolblathana, which is huge. And we get a buff. But I think we get him. Uh, we're going to hit for 10. So the last, last say is huge. Iced. Into what, though? A warrior. He doesn't get the buff on it, though. Uh, we just hit this for an 8. And... Easy. All right. Warriors. They're, they're actually hard counter it, but I, the buffs keep them from all this other stuff happening. Alright, so... Another one we want last say on. Uh, we go first. Alright. Okay. Oh, this is rough. We don't want these in hand. Okay. So... I think we're going to have to play the scenario round one. We're buffing Torque. I mean, that's pretty good. But we still start out with the Dunka. Do we use this for the bleed? Coded what? So he's clogged. He's giving us another one. Or is that just there for... For the laps? How does this die? Splendid crops this year, and ever they shall be. Leave it to me. Yeah, how does that die? Okay. It's gonna die now. Um, I think we go for it again, though. We might regret that if we need Simless. So that's one. Is this our pass? I don't think he's clogged. play one more. We got this engine down. Famous last words, right? So it is clog. Did we take the for sure buffs? We got it anyways. So he needs six. He's got sunset too, though. Like, yeah, I'm going to draw a bunch of garbage, but... At least these don't bleed. I 
I don't have an answer for you like surprises. what's it called. Yeah, I do not have an answer for. So he gets sunset out. Okay, beautiful. I think we two owe this guy. I think it can happen. I think I need. If I draw sinless, straight elevens too. Lucky elevens. There's one. Okay. Well, actually, we get two, but... Oh, beautiful. Do we want all that? I mean, they're engines, right? But do we overclog? I think we do. Alright. Here we go. Can we 2-0 this... This fool? Next we go scenario. Puppet Master, that's interesting. Obey your master. One, two, three, four, five. We're going for it. I think we could 2 0 this guy. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, if he grabs this, we're sad, but. And if he wants to grab it now, like... So he's gonna put... Ah, okay. That's fine. We get to grab it back in two turns, but he kills it, right? We just go here. Next we play Simless. We go for the straight buff on... well... No matter what it goes through, right? Yeah, you ain't, you ain't, it ain't happening, bro. Your life is great. That's fine. Take it's totally fine. Okay, go here. You are no Grab up these. Uh. I guess we just go here. We grab up our harvests. Um. Melee damage. Splendid crops this year, and ever they shall be. We go here, back row. Um, we go back row again. Oh, stop gurgling like that. We grab this up. We're up forty one points. Ithleen's gonna hit this for a bunch. Snowdrop's a lot of points with leader, but I think we're just gonna crush him. I mean, I just think we crush him. He doesn't have enough points. And he went slow with it. I mean, granted, he could steal a, you know, a six. But we can actually kill it. Um, I mean, anything we give him is going to be bigger than what he had, right? Uh, so we go Ithleen, back row, we get the double buff, 68 points, he's going to get, I guess he could steal this. Oh, he gets the snowdrop. Okay, so we get, but we get to kill one, right? And does he have enough points? What's this hit for? Thirteen. So he draws two more. This one dies then. What does he grab up? Do we just take it now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we, he doesn't get that little trick where he can. Oh, it's 15. Shit. So two turns. Do we 2 0 him? I think we do. 
I think it just happened. I think we smack him for a million. This is a big old uh, thing, but if he didn't draw his good card, fur cart into what? So Sunset Wander is going to be like a 16. I think we just take him. Ninety nine to forty five. Does he have a hundred fifty points in two cards? A tortoise and a sunset. He draws one card. He does. Depends on what the card is. Defender. <laughs> Get fucking bodied, clogger. Bodied. There ain't nothing to clog if you just draw all your cards. <laughs> oh man, that was brutal. That was brutal. We did it though. We don't pass there, I think we lose. Because we draw just a bunch of garbage, right? I guess we don't need to GG him. <laughs> Wow, that was a huge swing. It went from like him being down like 15 to being down 50. <laughs> Pro rank. There it is. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. I put three in here. Um, I really love this deck, man. I uh, the both versions are fine. Um, I do like having that little extra card draw with the um, council, but being able to tempo out with that scenario is just massive. I mean, it's absolutely massive. Um, let me know what you guys think. I think it's a really good deck. I um, it's something I'm really proud of that I created. I think it's super viable, and um, I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.